Hello everybody, it's me, and welcome back to another video. Now, in this video, I am going to be taking a look at another protagon. This isn't any other, this isn't any other kind of protagon, but this is actually <laughs> a Pure Bust SA one. Now, here's the moveset. This is going to be dodge, don't worry about it. This is going to be dodge. Let me just place it real quick. Am I doing something with Warm Kernel? Um, am I? I don't even know anymore. Alright, anyway. Wait, aside from that. Yeah, here's the moveset we're going to be using today. Tune Up, Dodge, Steel Crusher, and Thunder Strike. Oh, the freaking damage calculator lied to me. Oh my god. One momento. Okay, here we are. We're back. So, I thought that Tune Up was 25. And let me show you as to why. Um, So, if you go to the damage calculator here, right? What does this say? 20 freaking 5. Fix the damage calculator. I messed up everything that I did. I have all these notes right here. I had everything like written down. And then the fact that this is 15 kind of ruins everything for me. But we should be fine. Anyway, I did fix it. It works now. This is stupid. But anyway, yeah. I'm going to be Tune Up, Dodge, Steel Crusher, and Thunder Strike. Now, Tune Up is a uh, part of one of... I think it's probably on signature move. I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure if any other Lumines have it, but we can recalibrate our sensors to increase our range defense. And because we are robust, we just need to click this thing once and then we're very tanky. Um, and here are the TBs. It's, I would not recommend running this program. This is more of a meme set that I've done. But yeah, basically what the gist is, we're trying to swap into Teclips and then tune up and spam it. Um, we have Steel Crusher here. So we, we have Thunder Strike and Steel Crusher as a combo here. So we have a mixed combo. So we can Steel Crusher and Thunder Strike. Basically our Thunder Strike is there so we can hit those air and metal types and water types that try to wall us out with Steel Crusher. And Steel Crusher is there so we can beat up like things like Venolin, Ventation and such. And since um, we're going we're gonna to try to get our plus one, we have 96, so then we can pretty much 2 it KO. I think we can 2 it KO Venolin. We 2 it KO Venolin at plus 1. No, we, we don't even 2 it KO Venolin at plus 1. Anyway, but yeah, I'm excited. Hopefully you're excited, but yeah. I'm going to hope that we find some Teclipses today, some fun abilities we could do, like things like maybe, uh, what? <laughs> Not even sure we could grab, but <clears throat> let's see if we can have some fun. Anyway, let's hop in the first battle. All right, here we go. It's the first battle. Mmm, okay. Quite an interesting battle here. Um, if we actually take sharp focus, that'd be really cool. What's cool about this is that we can replicate and then swap, and then if this dies, we go into Theo. Oh, I forgot to explain the team synergy. Okay, your soul should not be here. First, okay, when I was making the team, I had to reverse rally Steel Crusher and Thunder Strike on Protocol, because for some reason it can't learn the MM. It was really stupid. And as I was doing that, I completely forgot who the second member of the team was. I just realized now we get walled by Obsidragon. We have memory. Um, yeah. So, I think we should be fine. And, okay, I am using Ikazune I I here because our team was pretty weak to electric. Like, weak, weak, weak. So, I was like, I'll bring Ikazune so I can get, like, a sweeping in. Like, a really big damage dealer. Um, and Theo's here for Barb so we can actually play this stall game, which I thought was going to be funny. I don't think it could work here, though. I think I'm just going to leave with this. That's my best option. I feel, I feel shotchy. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. I actually know that proto thing. It's the, I could spell, Halloween proto. Okay. I'm going to shadow split. I'm pretty sure I actually kill this thing. Mm-hmm. Holy crap, Yursel. Yursel is very strong. Your soul is very strong. This is actually one of my oldest of Lumi Legacy friends. Mm. They quit a while back, but now they're back. They're trying to get back in the game. Ooh. There we go. Mm. Mm. I forgot. 200 HP. It's just bulk. 44 energy. Is so you can use three tune ups, two dodges, and four steel crushers and thunder or thunder strikes. 160 and 96 is just there, so you get to 104. And 60, 160 is just so I can use, um, mm. it's just so then I can, it's just leftovers. Realize this is also proto soul. Hmm. <laughs> 
Here we go. Pick our tune up. <laughs> no! This is one looming we do not want to come into the field because we can't hit it. Dang it. Okay. Well, Citron's a problem. Okay. Hmm. I know I can't kill it, so I'm just going to Nimray. It's a safe option. Crap, it's nine. I did not realize that. All right, I'm just going to Gamma. Feels like it's a very, very safe option. I'm going to watch Hawkeye after this video. Then, an oh, I've now we can hit him with the Protagon. <gasps> oh, it's very clever. Oh, it's very clever. I see. Okay, that's fine. Mm. Is it? Oh my. Actually, I gave these to, to Mare. I remember. Uh, they asked for some PVPs, and I was like, alright, I just gave them some little baby PVPs in my box. Two, three more gamma pulses here. Everyone just don't say rage quit. It's so racist. Anyway, Invitation. I don't want to lose Nimrod. I don't even think I'd die, though. Mm. Can you walk? Walk? Yeah, I'm going to watch Hawkeye after this, so I'm pretty excited for that. Hawkeye is a really good show so far. I wanted to. One more gamble. Mm. Crap. That's very brawny ace. I gave that to Mare. Flinch. Flinch. Mm. Alright. Very brawny. I think you have to run quick pounce for chipped numeri. Alright. Uh, protocol. <laughs> Wait. We can take ace. Wait, we can take ace. Oh my god. Please. Please. No! 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 Dang it, that was such a cool plan, too. That is upsetting. <laughs> That's upsetting. I thought I could kill it, but I, I didn't. No, I didn't. Uh, well, it was cool for like three seconds. Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, we're fine. GG. GG, Earth Essence. Hmm. Good fight. Let's hop to the next one. Boom. All right, here we go into the next battle. This battle actually took me a little bit to find. Hmm. Tank could be cool. Uh, just replicate my own <laughs> attack. The point of this is so we can fight Eclipse. This is the best Eclipse counter in the game. And I can't use it because it's not here. <laughs> okay. Uh, Sharp Claws would be cool, but I can't hit Vesp. I don't have Surge. Thunderstrike, uh, would Awakening be cool? Because then it's basically, not sure. Um, I'm being lended this. This is not mine. A Nimrod is overpowered as crap here, so I'm going to bring that. Um, Yersel's good for Tab. Ta I don't really have a Vesp switch in. Um, I'm going to leave Barbs then, so then you can't, you can't go Vesp. Um, no electric moves. I'll have to go you, because I'm, I'm showcasing you. And I'll bring you, because I feel like, basically, we need to swap it against a spirit type move. Cephalopods. Okay, great. Great, great, great. Okay. Um, I'm just going to set up barbs immediately. Okay. Set up them barbs. 
I don't have trap removal on this team. Oh my god, it was a trap remover. That's what I had my team before. But which trap remover? What? Why go Gar? Why go Garlash? This thing doesn't have mudslide, right? <laughs> That'd be really funny. That would be very funny if it did. I just stabbed myself with a pen. Ow. <laughs> Outspeed it. Doesn't outspeed me. Yeah, it doesn't have an item. Who knew? Oh. Um, I didn't know I was I was fighting a, sh a shrewd blast. It has shrewd blast? Why does it have shrewd blast? Why does go flash have shrewd blast? That's so funny to me. That is so funny to me. I don't know why. I don't know why, but that is so funny to me. Why does it have shrewd blast? These are questions we have to ask ourselves. Okay. I personally think taking tank would be pretty cool here. So I'm going to break this thing's tank. Take tank myself. And I'm going to tank it because I'm robust. Right? Yeah, we're going to get... slap this thing. It doesn't have an item. Gorgeous. Okay. We're going to get punched in the face. Um, and then we're going to go... Instead of going to smart play, which is your slap slapdowning and KOing something. I'm going to go into protocon. Okay. Now I'm going to take his tank. I'm going to take that tank. Take it. Perfect. Took that tank. And I am just going to... I could energy stall him. Get poison chip. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to dooge. Okay. Okay. Let's thunder strike. Just for some damage. This is exactly why I did not want to use just steel crusher. Okay. Um, we're gonna tank it. Yeah, it was a crit. Dang, I only did 54 for a crit. Dang. Alright, we can just dodge here because it costs less energy. Or I could steal crusher and go for a melee increase. I'm gonna do that. Melee increase. Melee increase. Melee increase. Come on. Come on, give it to me. Dang it. Okay, it's fine. That's fine. I just I really wanted that, but not like I can control this game. Okay, ta tab comes in. I ain't gonna stay in versus this JJ. I'm gonna go into my your soul. Alright, I was trying to find swap ins for I know all the Protagon's freaking weaknesses. It's weak to very clever Rex. It's that's what I brought, didn't I? Mm-hmm. No. It's weak to very clever Rex, Metatode, Tartiki, Venolin, anything fast like very nimble Zulong. Crap like that, I'm gonna chase down. He doesn't swap. Who am I fighting? Oh my god, I thought. Oh, this is the wrong person. I thought it was. I thought it was like this guy. I'm so stupid. I should pay attention. Okay, it's fine. We'll, we'll just kill it. It's not like he can walk on water and run away from me. Okay, bye. Mm. I don't like that. Mmm. Mmm. Wait, I have Venolin. <laughs> Forgot. Alright then. Let's... Slime. The reason I'm using slime over adaptive because that's it. I I I have seen everything. <laughs> What? What? Dark Surge Cephalops? I'll take it. Bop. Mm. I'm gonna go into Protagon and take Analyze, get my plus one in range attack, and then Thunderstrike him in the face. Watch. 
or it'll completely fail and I'll die. But that's this is this this won't be options are gonna happen. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Don't rip me. I want to stall it. What if I could tune up and I live the T strike? Hold on. We could stall this thing with the protocol. We could go for it. I'm just going to kill it. Wait, I can't. I, I, under, I underspeed it. Oh my god, what have I done? I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm stupid. I need to think about these things before I click something. You know, I just click the green arrow and expect everything to work out, you know? Except for that one battle. That one battle. Hello? What's happening? I'm waiting. Uh oh, much better. I have completely forgot about that factor. Okay, never mind. I'm smart as crap. G -g 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 Let's go to the next battle. All right, here we go. Let's not have spoken. Good luck. Have fun. Into the next battle. Oh, God. Venom event. Oh, Venom event pivot team. Oh, it's going to be difficult. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't have Waba for Avatross. Oh, God. This isn't good. Yeah, I have to barter Avatross. Like, sure, I'm gonna lead. A I'm gonna lead Venelin. Hope he hopefully he goes Avi. And I can, if I can barter, that'd be amazing. If it goes Harf, I can go Nimere, and then he's gonna go Falk. So then I can go Your Soul. But I don't die to Gamma, right? And this is very smart. Even though I don't think I die either. Either way, <sighs> this is gonna be a very difficult game. I can't lose Venelin. That's what I can't lose. Okay, I'm I'm down. I'm not actually going to click barter. Um, he's gonna expect no. He's gonna expect that and go into Venelin, right? I can go into Ursul because he's he's not gonna stay in versus this. I know for a fact he's not because he knows Goblin is gonna lose it to Venelin. I'm just gonna go into my my Ursul. Hopefully, he goes in his Venelin. Yes. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> I need to chip this thing. That's how I win the game. He goes into event. I'm a chase. Oh my god. The chip. The chip. The chip. Okay. I'm gonna go into I could go to Nimere. Or I can go Luminami and play it safe and then um flash on the I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna play it safe and go Lumi. In case he goes into Venelin. Which best case scenario he does. No he doesn't. I thought he would try to double and predict. But he didn't. I'm gonna flash. I, he doesn't have anything to absorb light, so I'm good to flash and flee here. It's like, ugh, what? I didn't bring Theo. I should have Barb. Barb's be so good here. No, he has Gob. Never mind. Ugh. Sorry, my brain's not really functioning humanly. Okay, we're technically also showcasing Protosol, but in a really weird way. <laughs> so trust me on the process here, people. Oh, he underspeeds. But how? Wait, what? I'm 53. What kind of speed? Mutation's 48, isn't it? He's got to be like no speed, you piece. Okay. Um, safest option is Protagon. And I could tune up and start spamming Seal Crusher. <laughs> this is actually a good scenario here. Cause see, since I'm I'm extremely defensive, he's gonna take his own chip damage from this. I'm gonna click Steel Crusher on Venelin, hopefully, because he's not staying in versus a T Strike. I'm gonna Steel Crusher. Very weird move set for Protagon, but I know how to play Protagon pretty well. I've been playing it since December eighth. Venelin, yeah, not this. Oh, it's Falk. That's still decent, right? Oh yes. Okay. 
Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, I can double Steel Crusher, which I think, I, honestly, I think Thunder Striking twice, I think it's also a better option, because I don't actually have higher melee attack yet. Um, actually, I do. Thunder Strike doesn't kill, though. That's, that's fine. <gasps> get full paired, get full paired, get full paired, get full paired. Oh, okay. Flash and Flee. So, I think it's a Radiant, that's definitely Radiant Forecast. Definitely Radiant Forecast. Um, okay, goes into Venom. Yeah, he's, he's, he's pivoting into Venolin. Um, he barters here, actually. I think I'm going to... I, I want to scout what he does in dodge. Or I could just steal Crusher straight up. That, or I just go straight into into Ursul. Preserve Progon for later. But honestly, if I want to win this game, I don't think Progon's very good here. I'm going to click Steel Crusher and crit him. So, that'll be nice. Or I can straight up miss. I mean, there's, there's a lot of different ways that this game could go. And the game just decided to go that way. Let me straight up miss. I mean, I'll live again, and then I can kill it. But I think it might outspeed me after minus two. So, let's hopefully actually hit it this time. Yeah, I would have been actually been able to kill this, this turn. That's fine. I think it actually, I think it outspeeds me. Venom's like, what, 83 speed? And Pergon's got to be above. It's going to be like 163. Yeah, I know. It outspeeds me unless it's sluggish. Yeah, it outspeeds me. He's going to straight up rejuve. Oh, that sucks. Oh, he's going to get the max. Okay, that's unfortunate. Get another melee attack rise. Okay, if I deja vu, I was originally running deja vu over dodge, and then I just didn't want to level it up because I like didn't have time and I was lazy. Um, <laughs> but dodge is also good here too, so I'm not worried. He's just gonna click rejuvenate. He can click adaptive actually. That's terrifying for him, cause okay, knowing that at minus two eighty six, knowing that is venom, so that is probably not sluggish, right? Let me go to. Venolin, right? And I'm gonna go sluggish. 77. Protagon at minus two is 73. So it could also be sluggish. But 77, nine. Yeah, I, I outspeed this thing. So I can slap down. It's fine if you go. I could have chased and actually killed that thing. But to be honest, I think we're fine doing this too. We actually win with Nimere right now. No item vent. Okay. He probably actually just doubles into Venolin, and I don't... Why did I... I should have just chased. That was the safest option. I thought he would stay in knowing that Venolin's dead, but no. Oh, he's just going to geyser. Okay. If it burns, I think it's fine. It's fine. Okay. This should be fine. We're just going to be dealing with nine damage every turn. Nine guaranteed damage. All right. Let's, per let's peace of mind, not perch. <laughs> peace of mind. He if he goes into Falkyrie, I think we can kill it with a plus one. Mm. And... Goblin Hemet we can deal with. It's Zulong I'm worried about, but he has a, uh, what? I think it's, if he does, if it's Zulong, he's going to be forced to reveal his last Lumen, I think. Falk, I think I kill, yeah, I ki I definitely kill. I most definitely kill. Okay. Um, Vent, Venno, Gobademic, Falkyrie. It's one Lumen left, which is either Avatross or Zulong, and Zulong would be the best case scenario for me. Because then all I have to do is barter it, and then Nimray wins later. But I actually think I live T-Strike in this range at plus one. Maybe 92. I don't think so. Damage calculator. Let me go. Nymure. Plus one range defense versus a Zulong. Smart. Electric Essence. What is that? It's 80. I think I have a code. I might Oko. He had speeds. Oh, he's speed investment. He's speed investment. I'm forced to go Venom and Barter. I thought he wouldn't be speed investment. Maybe Trust don't use speed investment. But I guess I guess so. It's kinda bad though. I mean it's fine. We can shadow sprint it, but we need to barter it. We have to barter it here. Go Lumi and pivot. That's what we have to do. We have to barter. Cause right now, Venolin Okay. This is fine. We need Venolin to kill Ventation, though. And Luminami is... It... Actually, I'll live T-Crash or Nosedive, I think. Because I am invested. It is Nosedive. Yeah, I had a feeling. Okay. This is scary. I didn't think he would... Out I don't think I actually would live T-Crash. Okay. Um, he's shackles. I can T-chomp, and if I flinch, that'd be absolutely game-saving. 
But right now, Venolin is my top priority at keeping alive. Because I can... Yeah, I think it's my top priority to keep Venolin alive. I need to actually hit this Thunder Chomp. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Flinch. Flinch. Okay, dang it. If I had gotten that flinch, that would have been absolutely incredible. But I didn't. Okay. We had... Had to keep Venolin alive. But risking the barter is actually the reason we're going to win this game. I could go Venolin right now. And he'd be forced to go his own Venolin. So I'm not going to let him do that. I think I'm just going to go Yurisol. And what I have to do is... It's going to be weird what I have to do. Because right here, I can click whatever move I want. It doesn't matter what I do. I could chase down. It doesn't matter. But whichever move costs the least amount of energy, which I could just Shadow Sprint, which is what I'm going to do because it costs the least amount of energy. And what he's going to do here is go into Ventation. And then I'm forced to go Venolin. And then I have to double. If he doubles, um, I go Yursel and chase down. I have to go Venolin. And if he battering rams or he clicks geyser, that'd be great. But then I have to double. Or I could just mud spatter twice, which is an option. Which I think that's actually my best option. Mud spattering twice. Yeah, that's my, that's my best option. I'm going to mud spatter twice. Because if he goes Venolin, he's under speed. And I, I'm bartered. So that'd be enough to kill, I think. And I win the game with Venolin. So I have to mud spatter here and kill this thing. And if... Yeah, he's going to go Venolin. Please go Venolin. Go Venolin. Go Venolin. Yes, he went Venolin. Okay, perfect. Beautiful. Is that enough? That's enough. I think that's gonna be that's gonna be close. That's gonna be very close. That's gonna be very close. Even if not, we do have Ursul, so we can just go into that and then chase down, then go into Venolin later and do the same strat here. See if it works. But if this works out, who am I fighting? Who, who, who is this guy? Is it, no, it's not him. Who is this guy? It's him. It's him. The quick pounce Venolin, dude. Quick pounce Venolin. Oh my gosh. Okay. Invitation comes in. This is fine. It's fine. I can slime, which I think kills. Yes, it does. Okay. Yeah, we win. We win. I'm going to keep it there. But yeah, it, it's it's completely fine. Oh, it's Goblin Yeah, he say he didn't play Goblin offensively at all during this game, which is one three, which is something he probably should have done, considering the team that I brought. His Goblin could have been a very scary offensive presence, but I did have Venolin, which is a hard counter to Goblin <laughs> What's he gonna do? Click Airblade? Is he gonna do that? Watch him click Health Gift. <laughs> he loses, and he knows that he can't break Venolin with Goblin Unless he crits me and flinches me with air whip somehow. <laughs> if he has it. It doesn't matter what he does. The game is completely over. It's just going to be a matter of time. Because he's not going to let this game go. He's going to keep air blading. And I'm just going to mud spatter. And he's going to hit, hit, click hypnotize again. But he's going to miss. So. It's fine. Honestly. I didn't fight any Teclipses today. And most teams I did today were not very good for Protagon. But honestly was definitely a good good showcasing i think it does very much hard wall not wall but hard counters to clips pretty well i'd say gg good good game pretty scary at the end we had we had to make sure he did everything we wanted him to which he did indeed do anyway that'll be the end of the video hope you guys did enjoy if you enjoy my um my body staring at you let me know anyway i go now peace